It is giving them hope that people will care and hear about what's happening inside. Kathy Clarreich keeps a lifeline between people in prison and the outside world with her work at Exchange for Change. She runs a writing program and her latest publication, Hear Us, Writing from the Inside During COVID, is an outlet for those often considered outcasts. We asked them to write something that would make us stop and pause, that would take our breath away, that we would really understand the impact of what they were suffering inside a closed environment. I dream of mentoring at-risk youth and showing them a different way. I dream of book signings and using that platform to address the overlooked issue of mass incarceration. Michelle Towson took part in these writing projects while serving time for a drug conviction. Exiled by her family, she says working with these volunteers made her feel less alone. It's the hardest thing in life to know that nobody cares. That's hard for anyone. <laughs> and so when people care and show you that they care, that's, that's important. It, it makes people feel whole again. Telling people about my redemption. Hear Us has entries from 58 incarcerated men and women from 10 states. We cannot just call people criminals, that we have to look at the humanity that's locked up. I'm Nancy Alvarez reporting.